fans were celebrating after the team's win Sunday, but what happened before the game still has people talking. It's two sides of you know, a very divisive issue. During the national anthem, 10 players sat and four stood in support next to them to protest comments made by President Donald Trump. Those 14 athletes joined at least 100 others in the NFL Sunday in taking a stand. And as fans watched, opinions came from all sides. No comment, really. I'm just happy the Saints won. Social media lit up, many using the hashtag Take a Knee. On Facebook, Wow Cafe and Wingery and Chalmette posted they would not show the Saints game, stating the action of several players will not be supported or praised. This now former Saints fan also posting a video showing her anger towards I'm, I'm the team just, by burning the gear she owned. I, I'm just utterly and totally disgusted. Screw you, NFL. I think it's making people think, and we're always a better country when people stop to think. People we spoke with say they see both sides of the issue, but feel players have a right to do what they want. We look at the contributions of Jesse Owens, uh, Jackie Robinson, John Carlos, Tommy Smith, Muhammad Ali, Billie Jean King. And because of each of the statements those people made through sports, our country has gotten even greater. We're at another challenge now. I'm a veteran of the Marine Corps. I'm very much a patriotic individual. I, I, I stand, I salute, and I support their right not to. Uh, that's a right given to them by the First Amendment. Um, and I think the person sitting in the White House should be defending that right. The NFL protest is no doubt controversial. I believe in their right to make a statement and make a protest. I also believe that the flag and the Pledge of Allegiance stand for something significant. But for or against, some fans say what happened Sunday won't stop them from cheering on the black and gold. Jay Cunningham, Eyewitness News.